Hello everyone, this is Hunter Steve here, and today we are going to be reacting to Ruby Volume 6, Episode 4, so that's how it is. Yep, that's the name of the title, so that's how it is. Um, honestly, I'm not really expecting much of this episode. If anything from this episode, we know Salem is going to be in here, because we know from the gif of last night when Rusty posted the gif, uh, we're going to see Salem. Like, you know, the state of the present. I'm going to see her and probably going to see Tyrion and all. Because we know Tyrion's in the volume because of the trailer. We know that for a fact. Cause Tyrion is going to come back. So we might get to see his new tail. That would be sweet. Uh, we're going to see what everyone's been up to after since the fall of Haven. Because we haven't seen the villain since volume 5, to be honest with you. We haven't seen him since then. Uh, and then we might get the... The next thing I think we might get to see is probably going to be Team Ruby and like the at the fallout of the backstory from last week with uh, what was Austin hiding because that's done now. So we might we're going to see the aftermath, see how Team Ruby is going to react to everything that they were shown and stuff like that. And maybe we might get something at the end, kind of like a cliffhanger to be like, see you next week. We might we might get a cliffhanger. I wonder what that might be though. That that'll be interesting to see what it might be. I'm not really expecting much of this week. This is kind of like a breather episode. But maybe we might get something fucking crazy. This would be like a holy shit and then, then they just end it for next week for episode five. We gotta wait a week um for Thanksgiving. Um, so, let's talk about last week's episode for episode three. I, you know, really thinking about it, and after everything that went down, we had a week to think about the episode. I was very conflicted, because I really did like it, and I also didn't like it at the same time. Uh, I would say it's the weakest episode of the volume so far, even though I didn't like it, okay. It's still a good episode, but it hasn't been as good as the other episodes, like, from episode one and episode two, because I really did like those episodes. They were really good. And then we get stuff, something like that. Uh, you know, I I did like the episode, episode three. Okay, I, I did like it, but it wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be, you know, because compared to, like, episode one and two, episode two of volume six is probably, like, the best in the series of how good it is. And then we get something like that. It was, it was good. It was just good. Okay. I really did like the episode. There was some things I found disappointing, but you can go watch my review to go find out what I did find disappointing or what I didn't like of it. You can go watch that. Um, yeah, that's just my general thoughts of episode three. I, I gave it like an eight out of ten episode. So, without any further ado, oh man, I'm, I'm nervous to see what they're going to show to us. Oh, God, I'm scared. <laughs> so, without any further ado, let's react to Ruby Volume 6, episode four. So, that's how it is in three, two, one. Play. Rooster Teeth. I really like that logo at the beginning. It's really cool. Now we're getting the opening. Oh man, here we go. I'm really curious of what we're gonna see in this short episode. I kind of I have a feeling of what we're gonna see, but maybe I'm right. We'll see. Because like what I said earlier, we're likely we know for a fact we're gonna see Salem. And the villains. We're going to see all of them. Again. And we're likely going to see, like, Team Movies Aftermath. Or maybe we might not. Who knows? We'll see. It would suck if we have to wait all the way until, like, next week just to see the Aftermath. We were made. The pharaohs born to fly. I can't wait to see the full song for this when the soundtrack comes out. Oh, man. Uh, this is just, Rising is such a good song, dude. I can't wait for the soundtrack. It's going to be really good. So, all the songs so far have been phenomenal. Like, Lion Eyes was really good from the Adam short. Um, Miracle from episode one and then, uh, Rising. So far, all the three songs have been excellent, so. Please stay, we'll find our way, and we'll catch that green together someday soon. Rising like the moon. Okay, here we go. Is it getting near the end, oh boy? Hmm, what's gonna happen? We're likely gonna see Sam first, to be honest. We might see it, her first. Oh, we'll see the aftermath right away! Oh shit! Uh, there was damn, so much look you at hadn't him. told us. How could you think that was okay? 
He looks so devastated. Let's look Professor? at that. Even what looks is tense. your plan to defeat Salem? Oh. I don't have one. Oh shit. Because you really just can't. Uh, oh! Whoa! Holy fuck, Crow! Yo! Even Crow! What the fuck, man? I was cursed. Holy shit! I gave my this aftermath! The what the fuck? In this world. All for nothing. I thought I was finally doing some good. But you are. Meeting you was the worst luck of my Holy fuck! You fucked! <laughs> Holy shit! And for Crow to say this, you're right hand man. You're all right. Oh, damn. What happened? He's gone. What? Bastard! Tell How is he gone? No, this is different. Huh? He's gone. Gone, gone? It's like he's locked himself deep inside my head. What? Our head? <laughs> What the fuck happened? I wanted to stop. He just left us. What are we gonna what do now? What the shit? Why did he just leave? We need to get a move on. Oh. It'll be dark before we know it, and every one of you is spewing negativity. Damn. I mean, not like it matters because of the relic, but there's a trail over there. Trails usually lead somewhere. Lady, I don't know who you think you are, but no buts. Oh shit! Get fucked. Understand <laughs> that you're upset. Honestly, I'm still coming to terms with the fact that this is humanity's second time around. But yeah. Oh, she even she saw know, it. We die. And I'll be damned if I've lived this long just to die out here in the cold. Damn. <laughs> Fuck it, right. Maria. Come on. Oh, shit, dude. So Osman is just gone, but where did he... Oh my god. Even for Crow to act like that, holy shit. Aww. No, up to you, buddy. I'm just going to be another one of his lives, aren't I? Mm-hmm. Of course not. Aww. You're your own person. Don't lie to him, Ruby. <laughs> We're better than that. Damn. I mean, he's being honest, but... She's trying, okay? She's just trying to be a leader. Oh! Oh! We're gonna see more! Oh, shit! We're gonna see how they get here. That's the castle. Oh my god! So he just got his ship in his way here. Yo, the fucking aftermath! That was not something I would expect from that. Here we go. We're back here. This is how they get here. I'm one. It's definitely gonna be the same castle as from the backstory, you know. I'm gonna get this way because it had the same windows and crap. Yeah, we need to see the entrance. Tyrion! Welcome back, oh welcome God. back. Yo, his new tail is dope. Just as much as we missed you. <laughs> Let's go. Ew. I really like his new tail. Holy shit, it's so cool. Speaking of which, oh. where is our fall maiden? Fuck. <laughs> oh, goodness, Tyrion. Emerald, come on. Don't tell me something happened oh to her. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> like, I Emerald. Oh, shit. Than just your tail. Oh, fuck. <laughs> He's just gonna go straight to the blades. <laughs> Cinder, is it here to protect Oh my god, I I was doing that as a joke, like it, But damn! They hide all of this, like they just we thought it was gonna Back be fu off. Oh man, just look at him. Emerald. Oh what you gonna do? I want oh, you to tell me boy. whose fault this was. Oh, Now. You gotta have to say Cinder. I knew she was gonna say it. Failed because of Cinder. Mm-hmm. She got too greedy. That's right. I want you to understand that mm -hmm. failure. What you gonna do? I want you to understand why Cinder must be left to toil in her isolation. 
until she redeems herself. Oh, shit. You mean she's alive? Yeah, she knows. No Even she knows. Damn. How could you know that? Are you questioning our divine safety? Oh, damn. <laughs> it's strange how she knows. <laughs> of course not. Uh, forgive me. It's important not to lose sight of what drives us. Love. Justice. Yes. Reverence. <laughs> the trailer. But the moment you put, you put your desires before, before my, my own, own they will lost be lost to you. To you. Damn. Damn. That was really intense. Oh my god. This isn't a threat. This is simply the truth. truth. Oh my god. The path to your desires is only found through me. Oh, damn. <clears throat> Look at all of them. And so we must press on. Ooh. You gotta do what you can now. The sword under Vacuo's Academy, Shade. Ooh. I have more to report. Oh. Does he know about Atlas? Damn, yeah, man, she really doesn't trust the Oh, and the children are taking the lamp to Atlas. Yep. That's where we're going next. <laughs> Not if I can help it. <gasps> we can hear me, we can Being led by Osborne. Damn, look at so He's the only man with a chance of getting through to Iron. Oh my god. If that happens, it. What the hell? What the fuck? I... Dude, just look at her! Oh my god, she is so pissed! Leave! Oh. Your grace, I can... Oh my god, what is happening? Come on. Like, you might want to leave, yeah. <laughs> She's just having a different hair trip, it's okay. Seriously, you just might want to leave. <laughs> God, look at this. I'm waiting for the shower. What's she gonna do? Oh, back here. Dude, this looks so pretty. I really love the snowy. Oh, we get Mr. Pop. Doesn't look like this is gonna let up. Nope. I just want to get this stupid relic to Atlas. Let's hope we don't have to walk all the way. <laughs> that trail's led <laughs> Do you have nothing better to do than to harass a defenseless old lady? Everyone, quiet. Yeah. What you? Do you hear that? What you hearing? Oh yeah, you hear that? It's like the sound of a, a town. Oh my God, it is. Broken damage town now. Oh my goodness. Well, at least one good thing happened today. <laughs> it looks abandoned. Yeah, obviously. It's still better than this. Come on, I think we could all use some rest. <laughs> no kidding. <clears throat> God. Yeah, this is for even Crow to punch. Damn. Now it, oh, it's the end of the episode, isn't it? Yeah, I figured, I figured, I figured it was going to be the end of the episode, god damn it. Oh my goodness! Oh my god. Wow. That was actually a really good episode, even though it was short. It was short and speed to the point. Wow. Oh my goodness. First, let's talk about the aftermath of Ruby before we get into, like, you know, the villain stuff. Damn, even for Crow to go out and just punch Oscar in the face, even though it was Osborne doing the moment, it was... He still punched... Damn, man! Like... Even uh, like even Crow is just, like, my worst bad luck was meeting you. It's just, oh my god, like... And now Ospin is just straight up gone to what extent, we don't know. 
Like, he just walked up somewhere. This He just ran away. He was like, screw this. Like, the truth out there now. Like, honestly, it wasn't even that bad of a truth. Like, I can understand where they're coming from, okay? Like, all of the stuff that you have been doing from now until later was all for nothing, okay? Even, yeah, if everything was for nothing, like, you were just doomed to fail, yeah, I'll be kind of upset too, and so would a lot of you, okay? You would be. But just seeing that in the aftermath of all of that, going to that extent, that was intense, okay? That was really intense. And I really love, I, I love Maria. She's great. There's definitely some, like, even she, um, it really seems like that she d didn't know about all of this in the past and stuff like that. She was just new. Because a lot of people think that she knew about this stuff, but the way she was saying is like, even she's kind of like, oh my god, like, damn, this is real, like, right now. <sighs> she was really shocked about the humanity, like, there was another humanity before her and everything else, and she, damn, then she dies from the snow at that point, I'm like, wow. <laughs> oh, man, that was, just the aftermath of all of this was really intense. It really was, but it was so good. I really loved how they handled all of that, like... Yeah, that was. But I do wonder, though, how long is Ozpin going to be gone for? Okay, like, how long is he going to be? Because... And now once the same... Like, Salem wanted, wanted to go to Vacuo to be in the next step. But then she... Okay, let's go to the villains stuff. They really, in the trailer, like, they hide a lot of stuff from the trailer. Because, uh... What the... With the Tyrion and Emo thing, that was outside of the chamber and everything, the castle. It, it wasn't inside, as it was speculated. And so many things, I think, changed around just to hide spoilers, which was crazy. Uh, just seeing Hazel trying to keep Cinder, like, you know, away and everything. Like, trying to get full responsibility on him to be like, yeah, I was the one that made this thing fail, even though we know as the audience it was Cinder, and for Emerald to say that, that was... Yeah, like... Just seeing Emerald say that, it was just like... Oof. It's just, oh, man. I was really worried for Hazel there for a second, even though I don't like Hazel with, like... Even though he's a villain, I was like, oh my god, like, is she gonna kill the dude? Like... <laughs> but we... If the, uh, at, like, Haven thing won, like, the villains won for Haven, uh, they would have gone to Vacuo. So that's, like, we're gonna be next after Atlas. That's kind of, like, a hint-hint to the audience that Vacuo is likely gonna be next, okay? But, yeah, Atlas is where we're going right now. The villains are gonna go to the, to what extent, um, we don't know who's gonna go. It actually could be Salem that might go and do it herself. It, it really could be that, you know, because even Tyrion was like, hey, let me go back, back over there to give my revenge after what happened in Volume 4. And I was like, oh, we match it. And I'll be like, <laughs> and it was like oh, we match uh, Clove versus Tyrion. That would be awesome. But I'm getting the feeling Salem is likely going to do stuff on her own from now on for a little bit. Probably for Atlas, probably do the stuff for her own. Maybe. Uh, but yeah, overall, it was it was a nice, it was a really good episode, guys. It was really good. I really loved how they handled it. And the stuff at the end of the episode, you know, with uh, the town and everything, it kind of reminded me that maybe we might go to a mine, you know, from the opening, the mine and stuff like that. Maybe that's where that's going to lead to. And then we might just get to see the tentacle monster and stuff like that. That's probably what that's going to lead to, maybe. But we'll find out. But just, wow. It was a really good episode, guys. It was really good. <sighs> so, yeah. This has been Hunt SD here. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And see you guys like these. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. <laughs>